Now we all know that eco mode gives you more miles and also much more of a workout. Whereas turbo mode offers more power, more fun. But the big question, when you put an e-mountain bike into the hills, what does one mode do that the other cannot? Hmm, time for some challenges. Time for challenges for sure. So today, eco versus turbo. Time then to roll the dice, or should I say, time to pick the shortest broken lollipop stick. <laughs> oh, longest straw wins, right? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Me for turbo, you're an eco, unlucky. Dang. You won the toss, the roll of the dice, the break of the pointless stick. Uh, can I just start off by introducing you to Lakeside? Lakeside. Now, Lakeside is where they hold the World Darts Championship. On this occasion, it's where we start off our competition for real. Ah, oh, this looks pretty tech. Well, this is a nice spot, Steve. Are well, we down here for some ice cream? This is where we begin this fully pointless exercise of boy versus old man and eco. And it's a trial challenge. Ah, oh, what? Up to the top there. I'm just going to put a stone on the ground. Okay, Chris, the yeah. stone marks the spot. I'm going to put it marks the end. just up here by this terrier turd. Oh, what? That looks pretty tech. Just to make sure you don't get your ties in it. What happens <laughs> if you take a dip in the ocean? Right, Steve, how are we judging this challenge? Is it like a normal trials challenge? You know, furthest clean or timed or what? What are we doing? Somehow I feel there's little point. I mean, you're going to be in boost mode. Yeah. How am I going to compete in eco? I think it's, it's all point. about. I think it's all about line choice and that power you're going to get. So let's take a look at it then. Yeah. A bit of gamesmanship right. there. Do you like that? <laughs> right. He's just going to spin out. Ready? Let's He's go. just going to spin out. The long line, line choice for starters. He's cleaned it. He's cleaned it. Good luck with that one. Oh dear. Okay. The thing with eco is you just take your time. There's things like this. Hashtag eco climb. Oh, watch that route. Come on. Look I think you'll that. find that that is a clean. Nice. Well, I'm not going to lie, Steve, that was pretty impressive. It looked pretty controlled. I think with boost mode, a bit of wheel spin going Don't on. Don't try to sweet-talk me. But you were so smooth me. on that. Don't try to sweet-talk me. That didn't prove anything. Really? It's time to step things up considerably. Right, Steve, so it's pretty even on the trials challenge. How about a head-to-head -head sprint challenge? How about it? What do you think? From this yellow, uh, from this white marker to the yellow flag. Not really into it, really. You're not into it. It's about as well matched as my t-shirt and my helmet. Ah, you'd be fine. I think if we go any further than that, we're going to be above that 25k limit. Right. So stand and start, head to head. First one to the yellow flag. A nice headwind as well. Look at this. This is going to be perfect. Lovely headwind. Count us in. Three, two, one. Oh, you jump start. Above that 25k, easy! I want to see your screen. Was that really in eco then? I think well, you flipped that to boost mode then, didn't you? Wow, well, Chris, this isn't going so well for you really, is it? Uh, you turned that back down from boost mode. Dude, <laughs> if you want to do that 10 times over, I'm happy to do that. Let's do a rerun. That is bad sportsmanship. <laughs> Can't take it, dude. Can't take it. <laughs> oh, Chris, it seems to me like the old terrier turd is following us around. Get that out of the way. I think we've got another challenge coming on. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all seriousness, listen, yeah. uh, where do you envisage that your turbo mode is going to have the upper hand? Well, I think turbo mode for those big explosive movements, that's when it comes into play, right? Uh, just one thing, yeah. when was the last time you had a big explosive movement? Uh, this morning after that curry we had last night. 
All right, what have we got here? Challenge number three. Big obstacle trial style. So we've got an uphill run up, and then we're gonna try and get over this big rock. So you're gonna get double the points on this one. If you win this challenge, it's double your points. You're first. Where did you just make that up, Bev? Out of thin air? Yeah, let's do it. Well, before we kick this one off, Steve, I wanna scrutinize your bike. I wanna make sure you are definitely in eco mode. Look, you cheating Right, eco. Is that better? Nice bit of acting. It was already an eco. He just wants to bring a bit of drama into the proceedings. Right, let's watch you try and I get tell you this what, rock then. See how this is for long. Uh, Chris, I'm genuinely a little bit nervous about this. Right. I've got an uphill start into a rock. Yeah. Uh, I might need a bit of mind in that. Can you go on the outside? There's a high chance I'm going to fall off. You're going to get me, right? I'm going to get you. You got my back? I got your back, always. Oh, hell. I'm ge genuinely nervous about it. I'm genuinely nervous about this. Oh, oh. oh easy. Get up there. Stevie Burns yes. strikes again. No. Get in there. <laughs> Spotter? Nah. Walk in the park. It looks quite steep as you come off of it though. That's the worst off thing. Of, off yeah. of it. You doing a right. spotter? Mmm. But like here or something? Yeah, that'll do. Yeah. Spotter might here. Be a bit in the way. Right, out of the way then. Do it out the way. Excuse me is the word. Boost mode engaged. Let's go. Oh. <laughs> yes! Double points! <laughs> Double points! <laughs> <laughs> I thought, yeah, I didn't. I went to come off this side, and I was like, I'm going to go with the bus. Keep the excuses going all day long. <laughs> this ain't going so well for him, is it? Uh, hey, listen, this was meant to be a humiliation for the person in Eco. Seems to be going that way. <laughs> wow, I don't know about that. First one was a tie. Second one, I think you had a bit of a head start. And third one, well, I'll give you that. So I think we'll try this one out oh, instead. Don't be like that. Let's just keep the drama going. It makes ah. it seem better for me. What have you got here then? <laughs> so a double rock roller. Now this looks pretty slippy. It is on limestone, but there's a load of loose stuff. I think you're gonna struggle on this second slope, Steve, especially in eco mode. Because this is e-bike territory, full stop. Mm -hmm. I don't fancy your chances. Right, listen, guys. Well, I'm just gonna go for it. I'm just gonna go for it. Get it. Oh, ah, oh. nice. Look at this. Ah, 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 ah. Oh! There's the marker. Off for the beaten track. Cheating once again. There's the marker. <laughs> oh, front wheel, is it? Okay. Go on, Chris. Go on, Chris. Yeah. You right? Yeah. Uh, what was that? My finger, end of my finger. Okay, now sadly, uh, we've had to stop this video on this piece of conglomerate rock uh, because Chris has taken the top off his finger, uh, which goes to prove that riding a mountain bike or e-bike is a dangerous old game. I mean, Chris has had some big injuries in the past. You know, he does some ridiculous jumps down at Windhill Bike Park and other places all over the world. So. Uh, He's not feeling so good. I think we need to rush to the hospital to get the top of his finger uh, sewn back on. This is actually true. This is actually happening right now. You all right, Chris? I'm all right. Yeah. Get in there, yeah. yeah. No, this is happening. So uh, we're going to have to leave it at that. Um, it doesn't really matter about the results. Uh, I think we all agree that we all have gone out and about on our mountain bikes. Just happen sometimes so uh let us know your thoughts on this video and the dangers involved in it uh, don't forget to subscribe to us on social media and give us thumbs up or down if you like or don't like this video we gotta go